Hello everyone, welcome to our video today, where we will be discussing the difference between autism and Asperger syndrome. These two terms are often used interchangeably, but they are actually two distinct conditions that fall under the autism spectrum disorder. What is autism? Autism is a neurodevelopmentally disorder that affects a person's ability to communicate, interact socially, and display repetitive behaviors. It is usually diagnosed in early childhood and is often characterized by challenges in social interactions, communication, and repetitive behaviors. Some common signs of autism include avoiding eye contact, difficulty understanding social cues and body language, delayed speech or language development, and engaging in repetitive behaviors such as rocking, hand flapping or spinning objects. What is Asperger's syndrome? Asperger's syndrome is also a neurodevelopmentally disorder that falls under the autism spectrum. It is similar to autism, but is often characterized by milder symptoms, especially in terms of language and cognitive development. Individuals with Asperger's syndrome typically have average or above average intelligence, and their speech and language development is often typical. However, they may struggle with social communication and interaction, have difficulty understanding social cues, and may have obsessive interests in specific topics or activities. Differences between Autism and Asperger's Syndrome While Autism and Asperger's Syndrome share many similarities, there are some key differences between the two conditions. Language Development One of the most significant differences between Autism and Asperger's Syndrome is in the area of language development. Children with autism often have delayed language development or may not speak at all, while those with Asperger's syndrome typically have typical language development. Communication Individuals with Asperger's syndrome may have difficulty with social communication and understanding social cues, but they often have a strong desire to interact with others. On the other hand, individuals with autism may be less interested in social interaction altogether. Repetitive behaviors. Another difference between the two conditions is in the area of repetitive behaviors. Individuals with Asperger's syndrome may engage in repetitive behaviors, but they are typically less severe than those seen in autism. Individuals with autism often engage in more intense and frequent repetitive behaviors. Treatment options. There is no known cure for either autism or Asperger's syndrome. However, there are many treatment options available to help manage the symptoms and improve quality of life. Some common treatment options for both conditions include speech therapy, occupational therapy, and behavioral therapy. These therapies can help individuals with autism or Asperger's syndrome develop social skills, improve communication, and learn coping strategies for managing their symptoms. In conclusion, while autism and Asperger's syndrome are both neurodevelopmentally disorders that fall under the autism spectrum, they have some key differences. Autism is characterized by delayed language development, social communication challenges, and more intense repetitive behaviors, while Asperger's syndrome typically has typical language development and milder repetitive behaviors. While there is no cure for either condition, there are many treatment options available to help manage symptoms and improve quality of life. If you or someone you know is exhibiting symptoms of autism or Asperger's syndrome, it is important to seek professional help for an accurate diagnosis and appropriate treatment. Thank you for watching, and we hope that this video has been informative and helpful. If you like this video and want to more videos like that, please subscribe to our channel and click the notification button.